when I got interested in uh, blockchain about a year ago. I was uh, reading about uh, the, you know, the, the kind of presentations that software companies give to venture capitalists. And I became aware that blockchain technology was going to change the chemical basis of life as we know it. <laughs> Imagine a world where everybody was honest, and everybody was transparent, and everybody was accurate, and never changed their mind about anything, and you never tried to be somebody else. Well, you know, Google could open up some file and we could all just write messages to this file and, and we look for them and when something came up that was interesting to us, we read it and use it, right? But the world's not like that, so we've never thought that that was a good idea. Along comes blockchain and it gives you the tools for making that kind of thing possible. So, yeah, is there in that particular case, could you go to one person and say, hey, this blockchain would be great for you guys, and you don't have to form a consortium. But I'm the speaker right before the speaker for the consortium. So now might be a good time to talk about how you can put together a consortium of financial institutions to create a blockchain that they all use.